All right, no run of McMuffin for you. <laughs> I'm gonna I guess get she gets some. Egg and cheese sandwich too. I'm gonna get some other bread. I guess it's a blooper, but hey. Good morning, everyone. Martin here, and getting ready to start our uh, Sunday morning outdoor breakfast. And today, oh, let me get started. Oh yeah, there we got fire. Um, today. I uh, got to cover a couple of things real quick while this is heating up um, That happened from last week. We had if you remember right, I'll put a, a, a little short clip of it here, but we had a, a, a Huge painted turtle. It was about that big come wandering up the driveway last week and uh, We put a camera on it and it wouldn't move and so we waited all the way through breakfast and finally it moved but uh, we never we never caught it moving. We just caught it on film. So I'm gonna update you on that. And then We have another thing on Shelly's book that I want to do a little bit later, but let's get started. Uh, Shelly's over here somewhere. There she is. Okay. And she's getting the fire going, but she's also here. Ah, there's there, my book. There it is. <laughs> and uh, we have gotten all the updates made to it. Uh, there wasn't very many. There was just a couple of numbers that were not right. So anyway, we got that fixed and... Okay, so uh, we will put a link down in the description below where you can order that. Now, if you want a signed copy, she will sign a copy for you, but you'll have to wait until our shipment arrives so that she can sign one and ship it to you. Yes. Uh, if, if that's what you want, then you just need to put a comment down below in the comment section and uh, we'll connect up with you that way. This is Treasures of Life. Experience the treasures. And it's a daily devotional and it's... 90 pages or 90 days i should say anyway it's something which pretty much translates into 90 pages too. <laughs> yep yep hope you guys are having a, a blessed day today you know martin it's good to get together with family and we're going to be getting together with family today later yep. on i've got a little bit of bacon to do this morning so gotta get on it here yep. So Shelly put in her order for a run of McMuffin. Yes. If you don't know what a run of McMuffin <laughs> is, it's like an egg McMuffin only uh, made outside at Camp Runamuck. Yeah. Okay. I like them. Starts with a English muffin. Yes. <laughs> well, Martin's just gonna have a plain. And I'm just gonna have a Fried egg sandwich. Fried egg sandwich. <clears throat> Fried egg and cheese sandwich. Cheese, yep. Cheese goes good with everything. <laughs> I love cheese. That's a fact. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I meant to go visit my new friend locally here and uh, get some her eggs, but I just haven't had time. But I need to get some, some of her eggs. Oh, you know what we need. That Oh. The best part about running McMuffins and fried egg sandwiches is it's okay to break the yolk. That's part of the plan. Yeah, this breakfast doesn't take very long to get done. It's uh, it's really, really easy. But we got a lot of things that we want to try to get done today. So besides going to see family, and uh, so we're just making a really easy breakfast this morning. Oh, yeah. 
that. Yeah, that book, Shelley had written that book probably about six years ago or seven, maybe. It's been a while back. And uh, she, uh, in, in all the process of moving around that we've done and, and all of that, uh, she just kind of never did get a, another set of them reordered. And uh, so she's got the, and, and we knew that there was a couple of changes where there was a couple of numbers that were not quite right in them. And so we got that fixed. And <clears throat> and if you got one of the uh, uh, older versions of it, it's no big deal. I mean, there's just, you'll find it if you, that thing is giving me a bad time. There we go. <clears throat> yeah, they're actually going almost way too fast for me. Okay, there's that. Now, sometimes I'll put sausage on mine too, but I don't want to mess with making sausage this morning. There's that. So it's basically egg and cheese on both of them. That, oh, needed to put pepper on it. <clears throat> and that, okay, I think yours is ready if you want to grab a plate. There you go, a run of McMuffin. Can you see that okay? <laughs> hey, I finished. Oh, get your plate. <sighs> we can talk about that later. <gasps> All right, no run of McMuffin for you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna I guess get she gets some an egg and cheese sandwich too. I'm gonna get some other bread. I guess it's a blooper, but. Hey, I was trying to get it there. That's what happens when you delay. Ah, gee whiz. Okay. All right, we're starting this over again. One egg left. It better last this time, huh? what happens when you lose focus. You want to look at the flowers instead of getting your plate over there under the breakfast. Ah. There's an ongoing debate that goes on between me and Shelly all the time about when it's ready, you gotta go. Well, I'm gonna use some sharp cheese. You want, oh, I gotta Do you want salt and pepper? Yes. I gotta cut it. I can open it. All right, here we go. Oh, let me put this on the wall. You can put it on there. You okay. want the salt and pepper on there? Yeah. Okay, that's right there. Okay. So I guess we're having two fried egg and cheese sandwiches okay. this morning. Yeah. Are you good? good? All right. Yeah. Oh, let mine brown up a little bit more. I'll turn it over. Okay. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> I went and got me some sourdough bread. I like sourdough bread. Yeah, it's good bread, but as far as making sandwiches, you can eat on it all day. It's that well. got that much body to it. <laughs> 
Okay, let that, oh, that cheese is gonna melt in there. It's, oh, it's good. looking good. I'm gonna put this back, but I'll be Oh, right here, put back. this back too. Huh? Put this back too. All right, I would say we're ready. There you go, fried egg sandwich. You know, a lot of times they claim that uh, you're working with a five second rule. I don't think I'm gonna count the five second rule as valid today. Sorry about that. All right, there's our fire this morning. Oh. I'm gonna Shelly. Say hi. Right. Hi. Let me put a couple more on here. Might not see the fire while we're eating. Lord, we thank you for the beautiful morning and God, we're so thankful for food that we get in our bodies every day. And Lord, I thank you for um, these viewers and Lord bless them today and bless this food provided to our bodies in Jesus name. Amen. Ooh, All that right. fire is going. I hope it's not getting that camera too hot. I don't know if it is, we'll shut it off. Uh -huh. Okay, so here we are, breakfast, fried egg sandwich. How's yours taste? It's always better outside. I don't know why that is. Hmm. That is good. Is it as good as a run muffin? <laughs> yep. Because the sourdough bread is good. Right. We are coming up on the end of June down here. And, you know, I can already tell that the projects that we wanted to have done probably are not going to all get done. Well, We've been enjoying our permanent camp out down here just a little bit too much, or at least I have. Well, Shelly likes to work. Correct let, me, okay. let me tell you what I've been doing lately. I went the 21st and I went and got a bunch of blueberries. I picked like 10 buckets full of blueberries and then I put them in my freezer. I tried to triple bag them. Anyway, we'll probably have a video on that. It'll be on the Chicks and the Sticks channel. So that's Shelly's channel. And then, Chicks in the sticks. Yep. Go find it. You'll see the blueberries and the. And then I did went to the strawberry patch and I got like four flats of strawberries. Now I'm telling you what, these strawberries are like candy. They're like I gave him some, and what did you think about them? Oh, they're sweet. They were very, very, very sweet. And so I wanted to make sure I had that. So I got that done yesterday, and. It just takes a while to get it all done by the time you bag them up and do all that. So, but I got my berries for the winter, except I have the blackberries, but I'm not going to go get them until probably after 4th of July. So, yeah, I mentioned that it feels like we're on a permanent camp out down here. Our cabin is a 16 by 24 cabin. It's kind of a one room cabin with a additional bathroom room has, has a kitchen area but it's still a small cabin 400 square feet and it is it just feels like we're always camping <laughs> and that's not a bad thing that's a good thing we used to love going camping and would try to go almost every weekend if we could when our kids were little and now we're just like a we're what we're we're on a perpetual camp out. <laughs> it just never changes. <laughs> and I'm, I'm really good with that. Mm -hmm. I like it. We start our morning together, unless i am got something to go to. We start it by the campfire and drinking a cup of coffee together. Yep. Mm. By the way, I did get my hummingbird feeders out finally. And we have tons of hummingbirds right now. So I'm thankful. They went over by one of the windows before I had them out where I used to have them last year. And I think they know that's where I had them last year. And they kept looking in the window, looking for for the the goodies there. So we hung them out. I've got them all out there now. I'll try to video some sometime and put it on my link. Hmm. Good coffee.
I keep wanting to see a summer tanager. I've been looking for them, but last year I could see them while we were building the cabin. They were all over the place and I hear them, but I haven't seen them. He saw a summer tanager. They're really pretty. They're all completely red, the male is, and they're very pretty. They almost have the same color of a cardinal, but they don't have that little tuffet that a cardinal would have. I enjoy the birds. I wake up in the morning and I hear them and I walk out on the deck and here's these birds just welcoming me in the morning. I'm thinking, oh, I gotta get up because I gotta enjoy this. <laughs> yeah, right now, it starts getting light out here about 5.30. We don't have any curtains on our windows in there so the sun comes right on in and wakes us up. Yeah. And that's not a bad thing either. So, yeah. I like nature too. And at, on my run this morning, I said, I, I saw three doe, two fawns, um, two bucks, and a turtle. <laughs> Some of them deer, I think, are starting to get used to seeing me because the first ones, they, I was close to them, but they're like looking at me and I didn't do anything to them. They see me run by, so they were fine. But them bucks, you take a, they took a look at me and they go, what in the world's coming? And they took off. Well, I'm about done with mine. She's been talking, so she's got still a lot of a sandwich left there. Hey. How about we uh, do our toast? Okay. All right. So in our permanent, everyday camping trip, here's to having an excellent adventure. And may the stopping never start. Go down below, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell, and we'll see you next week for breakfast. Yep, see you guys. If you've enjoyed this video, give it a like and a share, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below and the notification bell. See you next time.